Hello everybody, welcome to another directed draw. Today we'll be drawing a snail. So let's get started. All right, so I'm having my paper wide like a wall or horizontally. And I'm gonna start right kind of over here. So to one side of the paper, the right side. So the first thing I'm gonna do is if you remember my other um, directed draw where I did the shells, there was one shell that I did that kind of looked like a snail shell. So that's what we're gonna do. If you haven't seen it, don't worry. I'll walk you through it. So I'm gonna start right here in the middle and I'm gonna go up and around like this. And as I go, I'm going wider and then I'm gonna close it. So mine is a little bit too much off to the side. I went the wrong direction. So if you wanted to do the other direction, you would start here and go this way. Actually, that's the same direction, sorry. Um, you would go this way and close. So either way, whichever one you have, they will both work. I'm gonna move this one over here for a little bit. And this one I'm gonna move a little down. All right, so from here, we want him to have a tail. So I'm gonna start back here and I'm gonna go line out and curve in. So it's like a curved letter V. And then from here, what you do is you're gonna curve up like this. And then do the letter V again. And then curve back down and into the shell. Okay, so you have your snail. If you want, you can add some eyes at the end of it, which are just dots. If you ever looked at a snail up close, the eyes kind of look like that. They're like circles. And then they just have a tiny little dot in the center. And then they have all these little bumps on them. But for this purpose, we're just gonna do circles. Okay, so now you've drawn a snail. Now if you wanted to do the opposite way, it's the same kind of thing. I'm gonna shrink this guy a little bit. All right, so you would start from here and you would, you can go out like this too and do the two lines like that. So I'll show you that again. So it's a curve line out, like an S curve almost. And then you do the letter V and you curve back. I know it's kind of like a weird little shape. And then you can put your eyes at the end of it. So again, you could do an S curve do like a U and then curve it back. Or if you want it just peeking out of the shell, you can do a short one and do your U or V and do that. The other way you can do a head is you can just do an upside down U and go back in and then add your eyes like this. I think this is cuter too. So either way you can do both. Okay, so that is how you draw a snail. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Have a wonderful day, stay safe, wash your hands, and I'll see you next time. Bye!